don't do that. Cheating me like this. When am I ever going to get rest in this house? I am your sister. Huh? Why are you always being mean to me? You will get rest and ample one at that when you are six feet below the ground. And believe me, that day is closer than you think. Let me go and come back and still get you here watching this kid. And I will deal with you even more. Idiot. <sighs> I'm sorry. I heard everything. I'm just like a candle in the wind. And you are the wind. And you will not stop till you blow me off completely. Afamivna, why do you want to shatter every bit of my life? Why? You're destroying me. You're killing me. Please. I don't understand. I'm your son and you're my mother. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Now leave, 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 leave. Get out! Oh my God! Ah! Don't say a word. God. God. God, what have I done? Well. Please. Oh, Lana. Please. You have agreed. Yes. With the condition that you will move in with me and the prince after we get married in the palace. So I will keep an eye on you and this cause. I will. Please, don't kill the child. Please. How I wish this knife is directed straight into his heart. Yes, please, please don't. I would have pierced it. Please don't. Mm. I have given you my words. But you are lucky. You are lucky. I promise. is sealed and buried. Any day you decide to dig and unseal it, the claws of death will pierce through your life and you will die a painful death. Uh, yes, I accept. I will do anything for you.
let you Leave this baby! Oh. Leave, leave, leave this baby! Come oh. on! Oh. Oh. Sorry, no. sorry. Oh. Oh. No. He must go! No, I said no. Don't worry about him. I will take care of him. How could you? How could you be so mean? Sorry, my baby. Sorry, my baby. Sorry. Sorry. I won't let you kill him. How could you be so mean? Hey, what's going on there? Sorry. Would you mind your business? Sorry, my Would you mind your business? Sorry. Sorry. Hey? Listen, if you don't mind your business, sorry. you go to harvest all this trouble. Tell them your harvest. Idiot. You are sleeping. But people I will. say that the full of evil, heartless sister. Mm. How long can this your evil last? How long can this your secret last? Oh, okay. Sister, sister, where is baby? He's not in his room. Is that why you're looking distanced? Now. Where, where is Mr. Lafayette? I don't understand. Sister, I should be asking you now. Eh? There was no salt in the house. I decided to go to my mango's this place, just this place, to buy salt. My baby was lying down here. So how did you now come to this place and my baby is no longer here? Are you trying to say that you left little Lafayette all by himself here? No. You were around? No. So how did you know he was here? This is where you mostly lay him any time he falls asleep. And he says that the entrance gate is wide open. Hey, maybe they've kidnapped him. God forbid, nobody will kidnap my child. Sister, if you're playing with me, stop it. I like your Kwamiya. I like your Kwamiya. I don't know who left the gate widely open, no. But that one is none of my business. I just want to see my son. I'm telling you, I just came back. Afan, where's my baby? Where's my baby? Hey, 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 hey. this is 
Me for now without telling me to look after him. I don't understand. You should have informed me. I came back. I didn't see anybody here. You don't see him anywhere in the see house. Him. Seriously. And he said the gate is wide open. Maybe I don't know. But they, they kidnapped him. God forbid bad thing. Nobody will kidnap my son. Nothing will happen to my son. I will go out and come back to this house with my son. Where is my son? Where do you think you are going? Oh, don't tell me. Come. That baby, the, uh, the, the mad woman is this is your child. Yes. And you think you will just collect your baby just like that? No. Eh? I know this woman, mad woman. She used to come to my shop to ask me for food. And I always chase her away. Eh? See, I don't. Okay, okay, okay. I think I bought bread for my children. See what you will do. Eh? Use, take this bread. Hey. Use, use it to. So that you can turn your child back from her. Yeah. You strategic style, no? Okay. So that you collect the baby. I will, madam. We have to go now. Come, madam. I wish you luck, oh, you hear? I told you not to go after him, but he wouldn't listen to me. I do not need a prophet to tell me that he is dead. And you are grieving. You know, money requires lots of energy. So I have decided to make your favorite meal so you can eat and have energy tomorrow. Hmm? He's not dead. He's not dying anytime soon. He will live, grow up, and make mommy proud. Coming with the food. <laughs> yes. I'll find you, baby. I'll find you, my son. Hey, so. Enjoy your meal. <laughs> eh? I 
would have loved to feed my son. But he's not here. Afamifuna, I know you'll come back home someday. Yes. Don't miss me so much. What am I celebrating? My son is not here. <laughs> I can't eat. What am I celebrating? But I know he'll be back someday. Yes. <laughs> Okay. It's as if you are beginning to lose your sanity. You are beginning to go gaga. Are you going mad? I need to know before it gets more serious. Eh? I don't want to bite me. I will not come and join you to become mad. No. Just tell me. Are you still normal? Are you still alright? Uh, I'll find you soon. I don't know when. <laughs> But certainly. Hey, I know you are missing me. I know you wish you were here. The only difference is that you are not here. But you will not die. No man will kill you. You are a destined child. Yes, yes. <laughs> Look at the way you guys are acting so suspicious. See, let it not be, eh? You, sto you, you steal this child. Because if you steal this child, no. I will blow your head. No, 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 no. How can I steal it's my own mother. child? I have got the face now. We resemble now. See, I go, I go steal my own If you are sure what I'm saying, then you may go. Thank you. Thank you. Stop here! 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 Stop here!
Attends, 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 attends,
Hello, Alana. Greetings, Miss. Greetings, how are you? Ah, what about your son, Afamefuna? He's fine, he's sleeping. Oh, I see, my little friend. <laughs> hey, Alana, how will you be kind enough to go to the kitchen and prepare my prince favorites? Vegetable soup and pounded lamb. Oh, please be fast about that. Okay, Ariel. My prince, nice to see you. Same here, Olana. I always forget her. Olana. Aren't you supposed to be assisting her in the kitchen? Come on, my prince. You don't expect me to go into the kitchen with this beautiful dress you got for me. It's gonna be ruined. <laughs> anyway, you're right. Forgive me. I actually forgot she looked at this way and you would want to go to the kitchen with her. So, Al, but not to worry. Can I get you juice? I can actually do that one, you know. No, it's right? okay. Uh, but meanwhile, um, the royal house sends their regards. I mean, the king and the lolo sends their regards oh across to you. Yeah, serious. Yeah. Well, I can't wait to pay them a visit, you know. Oh, please, do not tell them. I wanted to be a surprise. Well, if I go ahead and tell them that you're coming, it's no longer a surprise. Of course. Mm -hmm. So, don't worry, she'll be back soon. All on the priest, hurry up. <laughs> Come on, who told you I was about to negotiate for your information? I'm dating the Prince of Indiaco Kingdom, so money is not my problem. I will never be. Sister. Sister. Oh, my darling, for now I'll call you right back. Just give me a minute. Sister, please. The remaining money I had with me, I've already used it to buy drugs for baby. I also bought antibiotics and you know, things are very expensive now. I want you to help me with some money. Please, I need to buy baby's food. I don't have money. The prince is yet to give me my allowance, so that's no money. Sister, Bikun now, eh? Bikun, I just need, you mean you don't have even 1,000 naira to give me so I can buy pap and, and milk for baby? Because then... And milk for what? Like I said, I don't have money. Even the card I'm using to make this call, I borrowed it from MTN. I'm actually owing them 50,000 naira already. Hmm? Besides, this is not the same food you will buy and you will end up throwing it all over the floor. Hmm? Maybe the little man wants to fast. Yes, allow him to fast very well. And you're busy interrupting his prayer point from God. It makes no sense. Let him fast, dry fast for a couple of days. Maybe his prayer will be answered. So stop trying to interrupt his prayer point, okay? Sister, sister, Ina, go. What had me, Ina, go? Eh, he's just a baby. Bikun. Okay, should I go and take from your bag? Are you mad or something? Get out of my presence. Don't you. Oh, hello, my darling. Sorry for the interruption. <laughs> okay, you, you said that the golden and the black one, yeah? Okay, two of them. How much is it? 500,000. Uh, no problem at all. <laughs> Just send me your card number. I will forward the money to you at once. <laughs> Honestly, you know I love good things. <laughs> of course, I'll order more later. <laughs> All right, my darling. What do you want to buy? Customer, we quarreling. You're not answering my greetings. Did you come here to greet me or to buy something? Eh? Good morning, ma. Did you come to my shop to buy something or to, 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 to do what? Because if your reason of coming here is to buy another thing on credit, I can't sell it to you. Customer, Biko. You better go. I can't sell it to you. In a round, Customer, please. My hey, baby is starving. He hasn't eaten since morning. Just help me with milk. I promise you, I will pay you. <sighs> oh, before evening. Oh, Kambari, I will pay. Thank God he said it's your child and not mine. The last time you came to my shop and bought items, I sold it out of compassion to you. You've returned again. Emily Guilleme? Emily Guilleme? Huh? What? Madam, please. Leave my shop. Do you want my child to starve to death? Be gone. Your child. Yeah. Be Madam, gone. leave my shop. Hey. Madam, I leave my shop. Please, I know you're angry, man. I will go go and be gone. Go. Sima! Oh, 
Madam, what's your phone? You can see she stole my milk. Oh, huh? I'll be giving her an attempt here for free. Oh, for for granted. She gave me permission to collect the milk for her. See, let me explain to you. So it is true. I, I know that I don't have money, but she did not give me permission. I just will say I can't wear it. 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 I can't wear
since morning. And you didn't bother to check on us. Right? You that felt very filthy. And yet you didn't bother. I heard you stole from a shop owner and they got caught. How did you manage to escape? Sister Zirachi, you're so mean. You're so heartless. You heard and you couldn't even come to our rescue. You allowed me to face my face. Why, why are you so mean? I'm glad you saved your faith. Was I the one that sent you to go and steal in the first place? Sister Zirachi, why are you so mean? Steal. You know why all these things happen. I didn't steal. She misunderstood me. I asked you for money to buy food for Alpha Mepina. What did you do? You and I know you have this money in this house. Why are you so mean to us? Of course I do. I have the money. But how do you expect me to spend my money on this cursed child? Hmm? How? And for your information, I am the future queen of Indiaco Kingdom. You mind the way you talk to me because the last thing I need is for people to be referring to me as a sister to a thief like you. If you try this again, <laughs> you will regret the day you and I become sisters. Smelling thing, common thief. That's what you want. Get out! You better thing. Come and suck my breast. My baby, I'm coming. We are back home. And I'm Let me drink. Stop! Give me my son! What is it? Sarachi, what is your problem? Sarachi, I promised you with my blood that I will take this secret to the grave. Why are you trying to harm me? Why are you doing everything to harm him? I will not spill. Take it from me. No matter what happens, this remains our secret. Why? You're my own sister, Zerachi. You're not supposed to be treating me like this. Is it because I don't want to say a word? If I spill, if I mistakenly spill, you will be the one losing everything. Stop all this. You're beginning to frustrate me too much. What have I done wrong to you? I don't blame you. Take this out of my house. Take this out of my house. Stop. Stop. Do not mommy me. Your very existence waters the seeds of my pain. Don't come close to me! No! Shh! Shut up! Shut up! What did I do now? Mommy, what did I do? I said don't come close to me! This affected arm must be cut off before it causes an epidemic. I must get rid of her. I must. And I'll do that very fast. Yes. It's obvious to me that you enjoy doing laundry in your dreamland and you forgot to take your soap water with you. Hence, I decided to dress you with it. Sister, why? Why are 
my sister, why are you always treating me like this? When am I ever going to get rest in this house? I am your sister. Why are you always being mean to me? I, I was washing. I got tired. I didn't even know when I slept off. You will get rest and ample one at that when you are six feet below the ground. And believe me, that day is closer than you think. Let me go and come back and still get you here washing this clothes. And I will deal with you even more. Idiot. I'm just like a candle in the wind. And you are the wind. And you will not stop till you blow me off completely. Afamifna, why do you want to shatter every bit of my life? Why? You're destroying me. You're killing me. Please. I don't understand. I'm your son and you're my shut, mother. Shut up, shut up, shut up. Now leave, leave, leave. Leave! Get out! Oh my god! Ah! Don't say a word. God. God. God, what have I done? Well. He's innocent. He's innocent. He's innocent. He's just a child. I'm just frustrated. I'm just frustrated. Why is my sister doing this to me? Not like that honey you know the kids just came back from school and they are famished but you're busy upstairs freshening up uh, well that's weird because none of them have taken a spoon from their food that's true it's 
sweetheart. Why are you not eating? Don't you like it? But it's your favorite. Rice and chicken. We are not hungry. I don't understand. But you just returned from school. Or Mom. is there something I'm missing here? Mom, the truth is that we're not happy at all. Okay, so what is the problem? Mom, Dad, if you want to change our school. Yes, yes, we do. Okay, so what is wrong with your current school? Nothing, but we are unhappy with our school. Yes, we prefer South End Government School. We are unhappy with our other school. I don't like it. Yes. yes. Please, Daddy, accept our wish. Okay, so if I get you correctly, you want to leave your current prestigious private school to a government school without no moral value. Yes, Daddy. Yes, Daddy. That's what yes. we want. Yes, we like it like that. Yes, it's okay. Yes. yes. Please keep quiet. Shh. What made you think you can even come up with something as insane as this? Mommy, we don't like our school anymore. We want yes. to go to government school. Yes, mommy. Now listen to me. Let this be the very first and the last time that you guys will come up with such an unreasonable demand. You should be happy that your parents can afford to send you to a private school. Those in that unruly government school will be happy to have the kind of luxurious life that you are enjoying. You know what, Dad? Eat your food. I've lost my appetite. Wait. Me, I'm very hungry. Wait for me! What's the What you did to your father? Your own father, Nefechi? Eh? Uh -huh. I told you that I don't like pop. I like Tom, the German, and Beto Onubosu. You want to go and prepare me this? At least, if you want to go by 330, you could have been gone before 7 o'clock that I used to go to school. You want to go and prepare this? Even today's pop is just a day's one that I prepared for me. That's why I splashed it on your face. Uh, uh. Uh. That was why you plastered it on my face. Uh. Nefechi, repeat after me. You are a fool. You are a fool. You are a fool. fool. You are a fool. I say you are a fool. This boy, don't you know that I'm doing you a great favor? That pub you condemned mm. contains vitamin K. I and D. That's meaning kid. That's children. It is food for children and it also helps the brain. That's why I splash it on your face. So I can have a taste and have the brain not to be sleeping on your teeth. Oh. Oh, mom, mm. oh, mom, oh, mom. Oh, mom, oh, mom. Oh, mom, oh, mom. Oh, uh, my prince, <clears throat> this is the eleventh market days when the unfortunate incident that took the life of our Igwe and Lolo, your parents. We know you are hurt, and we also believe. You are still mourning. That's right. Uh, but we are here to let you know that uh, this throne has been vacant for a very long time. Oh, and, yeah. and we need to do something. Oh, where's Yoku? We need to do something. Uh, so that is why we are here. Nietzsche Kenemun. Ah, Mr. Dalo in Rinne. 
I appreciate your coming. The truth is, I am not ready to ascend the throne. Eh? Me? I am not psychologically fit to sit on this throne. Anything that compels me to sit on this throne is going to make me become the worst kind of king in the history of Njaku Kingdom. That is why we, the elders, are here to guide you. You don't have to be afraid. Uh, my prince, let me give you one instance that propels us to fight for this throne to be occupied immediately. When your father was alive, he had a business deal with some white men who wanted to explore gold and all that. In fact, they wanted to build a gold factory. That land beside the river, you know the land I'm talking about. That place where gold has eventually been discovered. Now, it requires the signature of the Igwe to ratify that agreement. Unfortunately, your father could not sign the day before he died. I am aware of this each year. I know. But those things are there. What, what, what are you talking about? Plus, you need to get a wife. Because the day of coronation is also the day of your traditional wedding. My prince. I am pleased to announce to you all that I have a bride. Uh huh? Uh -huh. Do. That's a good mm. But like I rightly said in the beginning that I am not psychologically fit to ascend the throne. When I am ready to sit on the throne of Ndiaku Kingdom, I'll call you all and let you know. My Prince, remember also that uh, the sun that hardened the clay also melt the wax. I was joking. Mm? At the same time, the time that can heal your wound can also destroy our kingdom if we don't act fast. Ndiche, mm -hmm. I will be on my way. Hey, oh hey. God, the radio hey, hey. Hey, hey. Hello? Mm. When you are ready, when you are ready, let us know. When you are ready, that we're not going to eat the food mom served. So they will get angry at them. So they will have pity on us. I don't remember us having that kind of discussion. Are you serious? Because I don't remember the time that we discussed anything about walking out from the dining table, pretending I that we're not hungry. Are you serious? That's it. Thank God it's when we don't eat the food, mom and dad will know that the last thing in our mind is food. Huh? And then they will change our school. Yes, of course, that was the plan. <laughs> what was the plan? <laughs> you forgot? You guys are joking. Because me, anytime I usually come back from school, I'm always very hungry. And you expect me to pretend I'm not hungry. Yes, of well, I think what we did downstairs didn't move mom and dad. So we are supposed to do something better so don't mean so don't know we really mean it. Yes, exactly. Do you have any idea? Yes, I got one. Mm -hmm. You know the ornaments downstairs, they are very precious to dad and mom. They love those expensive things, so why don't we go there and smash? Eh? Yes. That's a good plan. Yes. Count me out. Wait. Why? 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 Mm -hmm. Because those items are very precious to mom and dad, and you expect us to go and destroy it. <laughs> Not even by mistake, intentionally. Do you have any other idea? No. But count me out. No, oh, you're not out. You're in. So, when do we strike? 
Hmm. Maybe. My friends, <laughs> you're welcome. Mm. Your face is not bright. What happened? How did the meeting with the elders go? You know the usual problem with the elders of the village. I mean, when are you getting married? When are you ascending the throne? Um, my love, I want to ask you something. Okay, I'm listening. Go ahead and ask. Do you love me enough to make me your queen? Why do you ask? Because everything is suddenly appearing to me like you intend to do otherwise. I need to know, why are we not married yet? After all these years of dating, why? You know, as at the time when I was ready to settle down was the exact season I lost my both parents in motor accidents. It hasn't been easy with me because I've been trying to recuperate from that event. My love, are you trying to say that you have not recuperated even after I've been staying with you? Well, um, losing a parent is not easy. Talk more of losing two at the same time, same events, same incidents, same season. It, it, it's, it's been torturing for me. It's, it's okay. Like, I've been fighting this thing. Greetings, my friends. You're welcome, my friends. Hey, greetings. Um, I think I've cautioned you a few times from calling me Prince. Call me by my name, Chin Meremeze. That's my name. My prince, that would be disrespectful. Oh, but of course I'm okay with that. I mean, I don't have a problem with that. Trust me. That's my Sorry. name. It's okay. Um, where is that coming from? Um, awesome! Let me go. Hey. Oh, oh, I was just asking after you. Yeah. Good afternoon. How are you? Fine. I was in the kitchen washing the plates. Okay, that's great. That's great. Um, so what do we have here? You made uh, pepper soup or something? No, jollof. Jollof. Hey, yes. Okay, just to see if you. My friends. You know that I'm hungry, so yes. thank What's this? Ah. Ah. This is not how I served this meal. How did water get into the jello fries I prepared? Mm. You shot that stupid mouth of yours. Who are you asking? That stupid question. Who? Oh. So water from the water drum developed wings and dive into the food that you prepared. It's okay. I mean, the all I know makes good food. So if this happened, then that means there should be a mix up somewhere. It's alright. Alright? Thank you. I assisted my mother in the kitchen to prepare this food. And I can vouch for her that this is not the food that she dished out. Are you shot by your silly mouth, little twat? Who invited you to this adult discussion? Who? Um, she does. That is exactly who she is. She is my sister, and I know her better than any other person. I used to cover up for her, but not anymore. You know, she put these thorns simply because she's the only one preparing food in this house. And I guess she is tired of it. Sister, how could you? Oh. How can
can I pour water inside this food I stressed myself to make? Why would I do a thing like that? You hurt me so much, sister. You, my sister, you of all people should know that this is not one of the things I'm capable of doing. Um, my dear, it is. It is, eh? Um, Allah, it's okay. Stop crying, alright? Um, just wipe your tears. I mean, please come and get rid of this, okay? It's fine. I'm okay. Come and get rid of this. Go ahead and tell you. You expect me to be schooling her when you are the one who is automatically failing in your duties. Eh? As a woman, if you were busy making food for me, such mistakes would not be happening. Unlike as a human being, sometimes she could get tired of the things she does in the kitchen. And you're the other one who ought to be helping her in the house without doing anything. I'll be in the bedroom, please. Sir Prince, 